everyone. So I'm doing a little toy hunting today. I'm going to be stopping at Target and the mall that has Hot Topic and Justice and also uh, Toys R Us. And some of the things I'm looking for today are at Target. I'm hoping to find the new two-pack of the Ever After High dolls, Holly O'Hare and Poppy O'Hare. I saw that the Doll Circle and Shopaholic Knoll found those girls at Target. So, fingers crossed for that. And stop by Justice and maybe see if they have Dexter. I'm not too hopeful about that because my Justices seem to be like way behind everybody else and I haven't seen anyone find him yet. But yeah, and um, I'm hoping to get the vinyl figures of Applejack and Big Macintosh at uh, Hot Topic. And then at Toys R Us, I'll look for the uh, last few large Zelfs. Hopefully you can find those at Toys R Us. And also, um, any new uh, Monster High dolls. I know there's the Sport, the Ghoul Sports, and um, hopefully you can find... Uh, I really want to find Nate and Rot. It's the other hybrid, but... Um, yeah, so I'm going to go into Target first and look for the new uh, Ever After High uh, girls. So I'll see you guys inside. Hey everyone, so I got out of Target and the mall. And Target was a complete bust. There was no new Monster High or Ever After High dolls. And I even asked customer service to check in the back for Holly and Poppy, but they didn't have any, unfortunately. And Justice had nothing new. So I did get some stuff, as you can see, at Hot Topic. I got How to Train Your Dragons 2 Toothless Hot Topics exclusive figure. And then I got two more of the uh, mystery bags. Which, um, they took off the tags that showed the theme, but this one was, um, My Little Pony Muffins, which I assume has to do with Derpy, and this one was My Little Pony 2. So those should be fun to find out what's inside. And, um, also that I did not have Applejack or Big Macintosh, um, one of the associates there said that none of the Hot Topics in my area have gotten theirs yet. Even though it's been weeks and weeks and they've actually sent corporate an email about it. And he said he thought it might have been because so many people pre-ordered them that they didn't have enough to send to all the stores and had to make more. I don't know if that's for sure. He was just speculating. So yeah. Anyway, so um, the next door should be uh, Toys R Us. So see you guys there. Bye. Okay, so I'm at the um, Toys R Us, and they have the new series too. The only real new one is Rainbow Dash. So I don't think I want to get it just for Rainbow Dash. And there is no new Monster High at all. And no new Ever After High. So yeah, today's pretty disappointing hunting day, guys. Sorry about that. Yep, I think this is all for Toys R Us. He's pretty cool. I like him. Look at him. Uh, how to Train Your Dragon stuff is buy and get one 4% off. And so... I might get one of these and then get one 40% off over here. So that's all. And they look pretty cute. Like a blind bag. They're dollar ninety-nine. And two come in the pack. They look really cute. So I'm gonna get one to see what they look are. So this play. And this is actually what they look like. They're cute little characters. There's a 148 to collect. Okay, so I got out of Toys R Us and I didn't find any new Zelfs or Ever After High or Monster High, but I did get two of these hatching dragon eggs because they were buy one, get one 40% off. And then I got this little Funko um, 
Winter Soldier figure, but he has the mask on. And I guess this is one is kind of harder to find than him with his mask off. So, yeah, he looks cool. And then lastly, I found these little, uh, where did they go? They're hiding. They're so, I got two of these little Shopkins. Two Shopkins in a basket. And look, they are from Moose Toys, who makes the Zelfs in the Glitzy Globes. So yeah, it has two Shopkins, one basket, and one collector's guide. And I guess there's 148 to collect. So these are really cute, and I can't wait to open them. I think it's cool that they come in a basket. That would be good for, um, you know, playing with. It looks like the things are, like, you got lipstick and a cake, an apple, sort of cute little things. So they were $1.99. That seemed really cute. I like the little bas shopping cart basket they come in. Yeah, so I'm excited to see a new Moose Toy product out in this Series 1. So yeah, and um, I think that's it, guys, for this toy hunting trip. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing all the little things that I got. I didn't find anything too big, but found some cool stuff. And uh, thank you for watching so much. Um, please remember to like, subscribe, and comment. And you can also follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, which I will have those links in the description. And yeah, have a great day. Bye, everyone.